popped up with a girl or popped up with a boy. It doesn't matter. I want it. We'll Dude, I know. Even I know what a huge deal Armando Castillo is. Oh, and then it's us. Make sure you make a good impression. Oh, OMG. I love him. He's so charming. And we're already getting along really well. I think I have a real shot of getting a lead in the show. Don't get cold. Rehydrate. I want to get straight back What was that? How can you speak to a teacher that way? You've been acting weird all day. What's going on with you? I can't believe he's here. Why? We all knew there was a guest choreographer coming. What's the big deal? Are you mad they didn't ask you to choreograph the show? No, I'm mad they asked my father. Did you say father? Did you just say? Hi, Thea. You okay? That's a great question, Lena. Thanks for asking. I held on to a few things when Max and I broke up because, you know, he will eventually be begging for me to come back. But since I found out that I spent the last year dating a complete stranger, what's the point? Can somebody give the liar his stuff back, please? Mm -hmm. Thanks. You know what the worst part is? He didn't even tell me his father was Armando Castile. Very happy to have my assistant here with me today, who also happens to be my son. This is Ruben. Hey, guys. Nice to meet you. So wait, that guy's Max's brother? More secrets and lies. Okay, shh, shh, shh. let's get started, shall we? <laughs> oh, uh, cool moves in there, bro. But try to keep up with the choreography, unless unless it's too hard for you. I thought we weren't gonna do this. No, I said I wasn't gonna come to your little boys' club that you call a school, hermanito. But now you're in my world. This is payback. So are we done? Not even close. Hey. Very nice work in there, Chica. You've got real talent. What do you want? I'd like to have dinner with my son. Oh, OK. Um, I think Ruben's around here somewhere. Here we go. You're both my sons. Yeah, well, you took him, and then you sent me off to boarding school. Great parenting. Thank you, Dad. That's not the way it happened, and you know it. It's the way I remember it. Your mother took you both back to England. And then you insisted that Reuben come with you when you joined the Empire Ballet. No, Reuben came to New York with me when he didn't get into Harrow, and you did. And your mother was too busy globe-hopping to look after it. Don't talk to me about her. So I heard the kids talking. <laughs> you really say we were both dead? Did you have to make it so? Permanent. Why have you come here? Is it really to torture me? No. I came here to get to know you. Oh, great. So now you're interested in my life. OK. OK, let's see. After purposely getting expelled from Harrow just to torture your mother, you auditioned for the Grand Prix under an alias and won a spot in every elite ballet school in Europe. You picked the Paris Opera Ballet School not only because it was the best, but because you thought I would never come back here, right? But who do you think convinced your mum to let you come here? But yeah, you're right. I'm not interested. What's my favorite band? What's my favorite food? What is my favorite color? Hey, guys. What's for dinner? Perfect timing, as usual, Ruben. Here, you can have mine. But you know what his favorite color is? Chicken salad from Fancy Fresh Cafe. Band Halo Sun. Color green. You heard that? We all heard it. You heard everything? That you're an amazing dancer. How proud he is. Yeah, we heard that too. My parents adopted Ruben when we were still living in Spain. He was a street kid. He had no one. 
I worshipped him. Yeah. He was an incredible dancer. Even then, we were inseparable. And then... It's okay. You can tell me. Well, he came to visit me at boarding school, which was very different to what we were both used to. And he did his whole Reuben thing. He started a big fight. And I, I don't need to go into it, but it was big enough. It's just easier to pretend sometimes that you're alone, you know? I get it. I did a lot of strange things when I first got here. Trust me, being a princess can be weird. I've just wanted to pretend to be someone else sometimes too. Follow me. Come on. Nothing gets fixed by you just sitting there. <laughs> 